What is up, everyone? This is Red Dragon. Um, I am just having fun today, making some stuff work. <sighs> I want to go camping, and uh, I'm kind of tired of these one-pound propane tank cylinders for my Mr. Heater, buddy. So, what I went ahead and did... I just took off the spare tire and I picked up uh, this model, this 10 foot buddy heater hose that doesn't require a uh, filter. So I uh, picked up some 9 inch, two 9 inch cylindrical brackets if you will, and this is some of the tools that I used to put it together today. So I thought going out camping instead of using the one pound propane tank cylinders, I uh, picked up an uh, 11 pound from eBay, it was like 56 bucks. And that's gonna last us at least a weekend of heat, perhaps even all night long. So then I picked up these nine inch cylinder brackets from uh, I happened to get these ones from Walmart for 20 bucks, free shipping. And I went ahead and uh, just had some bolts lying around the garage and mounted it here. I like kind of the quick di disconnect idea. And this thing is on there really good. Um, theoretically, I could have that 10 foot line going from here coming up and actually going in the ventilated car uh, where the Mr. Heater buddy would be in there. So I thought it was kind of a cool setup that I hadn't seen before, especially on a CRV, um, especially on this model of CRV. Um, just went ahead and picked up some uh, cylindrical clamps, uh, made it fit on the car. Um, the cool thing is the spare tire here on this model of CRV can actually fit in the back of the cargo area. There's a full sized spare tire area down there. When you lift up the table, that's actually, if I open this up, there's gonna be a table underneath there that folds out into a table. And then there's a full size spare area. So I'm just gonna put my spare tire there and decided to mount this here where the spare tire is nice and convenient if i like to move it away from the car while i'm camping i can just disconnect it real quick take a couple seconds if i need to refill it i can disconnect it um, go get it refilled um, walk it over there to have the guy refill it or um, overnight i'm probably not gonna leave this like in the neighborhood just chilling so i'm gonna go ahead and disconnect these um, take the propane tank here and put it in the garage where it is ventilated. I keep uh, all of my combustible items here at the edge of the garage over there and that silly pink heart thing is like 10 gallons of propane and I'm going to go ahead and use um, that as a car carrier like like an overhead um, cargo. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and use that pink plastic shell. It's actually aerodynamic. There is 10 or 12 gallons of propane in there right now. But I wanted to get away from the idea of using the one gallon tanks. And I wanted to have some sort of an option where I could really use 11 pounds um, for a good weekend or so. That's quite a bit of propane for the little buddy heater. And it's portable. I can take this off quickly, get it filled um, when I'm out camping. You could theoretically leave it here and just run that 10 foot line from here to inside the car. I am paranoid. Um, I would probably have this, just take this off real quick and um, just put it uh, 10 feet away from the car on the opposite side of where the fire is. 
um, just because of the paranoia which I contain. Um, I just had this stuff lying around the garage, so this project was, uh, it was like $54 or whatever for the propane tank. Um, it was 40 bucks off Amazon for this model that does not require a filter. Um, the uh, cylindrical nine inch clamps were $20 each from <clears throat> Walmart. So that's what it looks like. And uh, like I say, guys, this is on there very sturdy because this is very sturdy and it's held on by eight bolts down there. Um, I like the rubber thing. I did see a couple cylindrical clamps out there from some camping websites and they were like 50 bucks each. So I went with these ones at 20 bucks from Walmart. Although you can find them on eBay and everywhere else out there. All right, guys, um, enjoy the video. Subscribe if you do like to make things and make things more efficient. This way, we're not going to be wasting some propane tank bottles, the one inch, the one gallon, my bad, propane tank bottles. And we're going to conserve um, some money by refilling our own tank. And we're not going to uh, fill up any more garbage lands uh, filled with those one, one pound tanks. So anyways, guys, Red Dragon here. Um, subscribe to my channel um, if you like to make things better.